Pushkonsky a lot closer this time, though, messing around. It's been on the viewers, we are here in Mandela Park Checking out some nice cars First I'll show you the cars and then we're gonna get to the drift itself Oh the paint job Look at that Dolph Nissan Skyline It's also Nissan Seat Mazda RX-7 Mercedes V8 compressor. Check out this one Irish girl car scene. All pink. Check out the trunk. Serious engine in that. Check it at BM and three. You can buy some of the accessories here, turbos, rims, exhaust pipes, shocks. I would imagine this is Irish race team. Here they prepared the drivers. Warming up the engine. I think they finish you when they finish the race they come here for pit stop. Estonia versus Ireland. He 
here we go. Here we go, look at this. Uh, Randall who goes for the back bumper straight away. Big initiation from Shanahan. Now, can Randall who hang with the pace? Can he hold on? He goes for an early transition. Randall who not messing around. He knows Shanahan's a man to beat. Shanahan slows down. Shanahan's off track. Randall who holds it together. Here we go, second half of the run. One more time battle underway. Jakub Pashkowski leads in. Calais Roven Power. Roven Power once again goes for that brave dive. He goes closer than we've seen anyone on that first corner. Backs out of his shallows up the angle. Goes for the dive. Down on the inside. Roven Power looking for the side of that Toyota GT86 as they come through. Down onto this transition. Up onto the wall goes Pashkonski and Roven Power. Roven Power way wide though. As Pashkonski takes it to the wall and across the line. It is James Dean in the lead position. Pashkonski in the chase position. Expect fireworks from the off as they fire into that first corner. Big angle from James Dean. Pashkonski now coming as fast as he can. Oh, Dean drops as wide as he can off the track. And now, look at Pashkonski making an error in the chase position, catching back up onto the door. You see Pashkonski just wobble a little in the chase position now. Pashkonski, wow, what a dive, but a little bit of a wobble again. Dean on massive angle as he comes through that last corner. And James Dean across the line, Pashkonski right with him. Look at this, through the gears, down they come. Peter stays away, gives Shanahan the room to flick across the track now. Peter starts to find him in. Peter grabs understeer. Almost straight lines through that part of the circuit. Gets back into it. Peter finds the side of that GT86 as they transition now in front of the grandstand. Down they come, up onto the wall. But Peter's closer than ever as Peter puts that S15 up onto the side of the GT86 and across the line. Look at this, he's gone past him again. This is very great for James Dean as they come into that first corner. Dean on the inside of the corner, Fjainsek wide on the corner. Dean making some big moves now, a big dive from Dean as he floats up onto the door. James Dean right with Peter Fjainsek as they transition back onto the wall. They go, James Dean puts it onto the door as close as he possibly can. Unbelievable. James Dean goes out in the final four and you know what? Just for a consolation prize, even though we are going to see an international driver break the streak. They're ready to rock and roll here at Mandela when Dean's off the line and ahead of Shannon on the running. As Jack Shannon pulls it through the gears, Dean fires in in the chase position, and Jack Shannon's on 90 degrees of angle. Oh! Massive error from Jack Shannon as he ends up in the tires. Is it Fjainsek? Is it Randall? Randall jumps the start. Fjainsek in the lead position. Randall has to throw everything at Fjainsek here as they come into that. Oh, Randall! What an entry from the Estonian, but he's lost it into the barrier and into the grass. Last run of the day. Here we go, Mondello Park. Fjainsek fires into the first corner with Oliver Randall and Fjainsek right there from the off. Nice transition from both drivers as they head to that outer zone. Randall, oh, a little error from Peter Fjainsek in the chase but he keeps the momentum going, and now Fjainsek starts to attack as they head towards the wall. Fjainsek keeps the nose of that car out of the BMW as they come around the last corner. Randalu and Fjainsek across the line they go. Randalu from Estonia versus Fjainsek from Poland to take history in Ireland. That's how you start the championship. Will it be Peter Fjainsek or Oliver Randalu to be the first international driver to ever win in Ireland? It's Peter Fjainsek! Peter Fjainsek gets the win. Fjainsek has done what no one has ever done before. History made at the biggest event in Irish Drift history. And wow, what a moment. Did you think that you were going to make history and be the first European driver to take it off the Irish? No way, no way. I wasn't thinking that I'm going to change the strike. And uh, now, now I can think about it, actually, because I try always to get this thought somewhere away. I'm overwhelmed, simply. I'm, I'm very happy to be here with, our, with such an amazing audience, with such an atmosphere. It was like in a stadium. Thank you, guys. You are the best.